Trying to walk it up, and with some progress, is Ekholm right in there? Big stop, rebound in front, scramble into the corner. Ekholm's got it. He'll work it back out. Subban works it over. There's a chance. Scores. It's over. Neal with the winner. This is overtime. He takes it down. He drives right to the net. And he creates all this havoc because it's a defenseman coming down into the play. And then it rotates to the point, and it's a one-timer for Neal. It hits something in front, and then Corey Perry goes down to block it. He can't get it. Fake shot by Sube into the wheelhouse of Neal, who left this game with an injury and came back prior to the five on three. And the sliding Perry can't get over quick enough. Gibson can't get over quick enough. And it starts with a great play from Ekholm. Look at the bodies that are laying around the net. Push it back to the point. You hear Don Cherry talking all the time, creating from the blue lines, creating from the blue lines. Well, great creation for the Nashville Predators. Their blue line's been chipping in all playoffs long. And this is a great one-timer by Neal. And what a great look as it goes off Corey Perry over the top of Gibson and into the net for the game-winning goal. You can see that Gibson had, uh, had lost his stick in that pandemonium in around the goal. Neal gets it. It's his fourth goal in the playoffs, his second career overtime winner. So Nashville come in, and as Gary put it, break serve. They win one on the road. Final score is 3-2. to two. That's the story here in Anaheim.